We are back at it again, guys, on my mini low-level Let's Play account. So, let's play. Um, oh, man, it's been so long since I've been on this account, and honestly, I can't wait to play some. Last episode, I used all riflemen, and I think I'm just going to start this episode out using all riflemen. I might have to switch over to a different combination a little later on in today's video, but it's a good start. Starting out all riflemen, it's a good combination. It's nice and strong, able to take down um, some serious bases, which is what we need right now. I'm just gonna drop a flare, completely avoid that machine gun on the left hand side. Flare to the headquarters. I'll probably hit that boom mine. Dang it, we lost one. We'll heal this guy up so we don't lose two or something. I hope all of you guys are having a great day. I'm sporting our new Cosmic Duo merchandise. This is new. Get instant training from the shop for all troops. You may also finish the loading for a one diamond. We're not gonna we're not gonna spend any diamonds right now. Last update, they changed it, so it's no longer called endless reserves. It's called instant training. Um, the main reason they did it was just to eliminate some um, vagueness about the endless reserves uh, because you know the name endless reserves you know like if you read the description it tells you what it is but just by the name of it it doesn't really tell you what it is so they just decided to go remove all vagueness and just call it instant training call it what it is no need to come up with a fancy name and i like it it's uh fits the name a lot better than endless reserves so not gonna buy it on this account you know 10 bucks a month is already hurting me <laughs> uh being a college kid so i'm not even going to consider buying it on a second account when it first came out i bought it on two accounts for the first um gosh how long was that for the first four months stage number three don't know if I'll be able to take it down. This stupid cannon is kind of hurting me right now. Dr. Gavon is just doing a little a little dance, wagging his his wand around in the air. I don't know why I said wagging. He's not a dog wagging a tail. He's waving his wand around. We lost 17. Is now the best time to switch? You know what? I'm going to keep pushing because I do like all riflemen and it's a very strong combination but we are gonna have to do some upgrading here do conversion and we'll look at our armory you know what i would love to upgrade my armory today um i feel like attacking maybe like an npc base a base that gives me a little bit of wood uh and not much not much of any other resource Drop a shock. We're just going to keep dropping shocks on this stupid rocket launcher until we are able to get inside its dead zone. We'll get Dr. Kavan up there. We could also drop some um, crystal critters if we want to. Speaking of crystal critters, there are so many people that want me to max out crystal critters. Guys, I'm not going to max out crystal critters on my maxed out account. I'm not, I'm not going to do that. Crystal Critters, me and Crystal Critters have like a love-hate relationship. And when I say love-hate, I mean I like them on this account because it's the only ability that I have unlocked that is healing my troops. Like I would have, I, I, like, as soon as I unlock Resurrection or the shield, I'm going to change uh, him. <laughs> I'm going to change his active ability to one of those. So that's what I mean by love hate. I love the fact that he's able to heal up troops passively, but I don't use the ability and I honestly don't care about crystal critters that much to upgrade it on my maxed account. Like now maxing out an ability is not cheap. It's 128 tokens, the last upgrade. So you don't want to just go around maxing out abilities because you feel like maxing out an ability. You wanna max out abilities. I just wasted that artillery. You wanna max out abilities you're gonna use later on. And there's no way me maxing out crystal critters will ever be worth it. Like I don't like crystal critters. Our bio on Instagram is literally two kids waiting for crystal critters to become useful. So 
like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna max out Crystal Critters. I'm not planning on a new hero dropping anytime soon, so I'm not going to go ahead and spend my tokens on one of these, even though I could probably get my tokens back before the next hero drops. Honestly, I'm expecting a new level of, um, okay, we're gonna find a new opponent here. I'm expecting a new level of Everspark and Bullet to come out before we get a new hero. Uh, that's just my personal take on the matter. I'm hoping that happens. Um, but also a new hero would be a lot of fun. But imagine level five or no, level six energy drink. Like that's all I need to say. Level six energy drink would be insane. It'd be so cool. Um, and also level six uh, critter swarm that'd be also super cool so you know I'm, I'm just gonna save my tokens for now not spend them on anything as for this account I am going to start upgrading like with my tokens I'm just gonna max out battle orders because battle orders needs to be upgraded um, you need it for operations if I ever want to move this account into a task force I, I'll need battle orders for operations so I'll just focus on battle orders it's nice having all those uh, tokens on my main account it's so nice being able to just max out a hero ability when it comes out the sniper tower is targeting a crystal critter which is so cool because the crystal critters act can act like a shield because they have so much HP but he goes down that's what you get for having a life statue um, we only lose 11 troops nice and we'll do we'll do that one okay uh, next one fireballs okay find a new opponent <laughs> I'm looking for easy bases to exploit this guy looks easy we'll gym up our troops we are getting full on gold I'm gonna see how much gold it costs I mean how much gold we earn okay we'll be fine this oh man he's online okay ooh yes 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 60,000 we're good we good one two one two troops nice going level one defenses are you honestly being honest it looks like he's used diamonds like he bought a bunch of diamonds and is gymming up and i'm only saying that because he doesn't have very good statues um when i say very good statues i mean guardians by this point level 27 he should have uh more guardians than he has now um so he's either not hitting the events not going far in the events or He's not jimming. I mean, or he's diamonding up. So, got a supply crate. Let's grab some life fragments. Trying to get closer to some more power powder. <laughs> At this point, you're just trying to build up your crystals. So you don't really get power powder until you're like level 40. Until you start actually building it up. But, we do have a lot of gold. And I'm not going to gym up my armory. Because I'm going to try to save diamonds. But we could upgrade or unlock some clouds. So that is what we're going to do. We're going on a cloud exhibition. Let's do this 250. We'll hope for something good. Nice. We got a level 21 who is online. We got an NPC base, which I'll easily just take out right now. Get two barrages in. Wound up some of these splash damage defenses. Take down some more. Drop a med kit for when this mortar fires. And. You know, my troops will hit the mines, but I think I'd rather spend my energy shocking the sniper tower instead. Oh, man, we lost a few. Dr. Kavan, man, what are you doing? Get up there. See. The problem is he doesn't stay with your troops, but the base goes down anyway. Some players are offline yet because I really want to beat some of these players. We'll do this base puncture. Uh, got some cannons, some single shot defenses, not going to be a problem. We're going to take down cannons because if I do have to burn the shield, I can at least take down the buildings around the, sh I mean, the core, not shield. But I can at least take down the buildings around the core 
which will help us lose less troops. Okay, puncture goes down. See, riflemen are very cheap, they're very effective, and they work very well at a lower level. Um, I keep hitting that stupid dive. Oh, good, he got a flan. He got a flan, he got a flan. Okay, someone who doesn't value offense, but he kind of does. He has a couple offensive statues, not only four statues. Is that normal? Might be normal. Might have to be level 22 to upgrade, and that's why he can't get the next level. Anyway, we'll just take him out quick. Not a big deal. We're going to drop a barrage to clear mines, actually. Because do not want my troops all dying by a couple mines. I'll take down this mortar back here. Come on. A little more energy. A little more. Come on. Oops. That was a mistake. Hmm. Okay. Dr. Kavan needs to help out here. <laughs> oh, man. The mortar's hurting me. That one artillery, guys. I could have saved so many more troops, but... It just... Oh, my God. I missed it again. I give up. I'm not going to be able to take down the mortar. It's just going to keep hitting my troops. <laughs> so, my main account, guys... Um, some people in my task force have noticed I am pushing once again. Uh, it feels so good to play Boom Beach. You know, at the start of the summer, I was telling myself I was going to push this summer. And I kind of pushed it back because I really didn't want to play a lot of Boom Beach at the beginning of summer. But now, towards the end of summer, kind of chilled. It's a very chill time. Um, going back to school in about five weeks. So I'm going to just take the next five weeks and just try to push as much as I possibly can. And I'm gonna hope to get up to around 800 medals. There's a lot of pure offensive players down at 600 where I'm at currently, but as soon as you start getting up higher, you get more and more players who are pushing. And I feel, first of all, I gotta take down the sniper tower. But I feel like this guy has ice or something. Okay, um, we'll get a reflare because I'm a little bit worried here. Drop a barrage. But I feel like once we get up to 800, I'll be able to just kind of coast my way back down because I don't play much during the school year. Um, so I'll be able to coast my way back down and I'll drop back down to around 500 by the end of the school year, which is fine. But last summer, I was at around 1250. And I dropped all the way down to... Gosh, these mortars are really hurting me. I need to drop a reflare. I want to wait till they take up the mortar. So last summer I pushed up to 1250. And then I dropped all the way down to five... Like 500 medals. But I'm planning on playing Boom Beach more this next upcoming school year. So, um... I should be... We should be fine. We should be able to stay around the 500 mark. Uh, by the end of the school year. So... I'm very pumped, guys. We should be getting a new Boom Beach update soon. Um, something I really haven't talked about. So, here's the deal. Boom Beach hasn't had an, uh, like a real legit update in... I mean, when I say a real legit update. We haven't had a big update in like a year. <laughs> it's been a while. Um, and Boom Beach keeps hyping up the next update. And um, we should be getting something cool. So, um, I don't know yet what it's going to be, the next Boom Beach update. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff I'm hoping for, but we won't know for certain until the update drops. But here's the deal. Finland, or is it Europe? Uh, Europe or Finland. I think it might just be Finland. But they take like a month off during the summertime, their employees. So... Boom Beach will be taking like a month off coming soon. They may, I don't think they took off July. So that means August, they'll be taking like a month off, which is very bad. Which means we won't really have an update. And it might be, they might be uh, pre programming stuff for like the Mega Crab, the Tribe Cycles, the events. But we won't have an update that whole month. So I'm guessing it, the next Boom Beach update will be coming in September. 
and it's going to be huge and I can't wait. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Let me know down below what you guys would like to see in the next Boom Beach update. It's not going to be task force versus task forces. Every time they do a Boom Beach AMA, people ask, are task force versus task forces coming? And they keep saying no. So I'm not expecting that, but hopefully we'll see something cool and I'll talk to you guys next time.